Uh, thanks to Greg for those races. Then I'm now at Garen Park for the Garen Park Novices Hurdle. Three mile one furlong. Long way for a hurdle race. Change for the better. Joshua Sutherland. Ultimate way. Leon Van Rensburg. Damaris Giza. Graham Clutterbuck. Straw Doll. David Robertson. And Vermillion Nira. Or oh, James Shea. Field of just five then. Away they go. Not surprised really. As if you're running this and it ends up being your best run, you're going to be ruled out of all the two mile four furlong handicaps. He might even be out of the two mile five ones, I'm not quite sure. I think he might be four furlongs on the jumps, isn't it? So he might be just about okay. But anyway, they're heading down towards the first of the 12. And all five of them will pick up some prize money if they all get round. Straw Doll is in front. Change for the better second. Ultimate Way is in third. And of a million nearer, James Shea's had a good comeback. Gray in there in fifth with Demary's Giza mixing it with the big boys in this one. Gray and Straw Doll is in the lead for David Robertson. Change for the better second. Black and red of Joshua Sutherland. Leon Van Rensburg's ultimate way is next. And that dark blue with a gold cap over the first flight. Eventually, James Shays of a million nearer is next. I also see James back and he's doing particularly well, especially on the flat as well. Demiris Giza, the back marker for Graham Clutterbuck, who's picked up some good wins already this season as well. Then over the fifth, over the fifth of the second, and Straw Dog. He's in the lead. Change for the better. In second. I suppose these will be all potentially heading off for whatever the spa hurdle is called these days at Cheltenham. The three more novice. Maybe they might try and sneak into the poor attempts. There's not that many chances to do that. I think two of them have gone already. Straw Doll is in the lead. Ultimate way is second. Change for the better third. And for a million nearer. Finally, Demiris Giza, the back marker. Straw Doll is a good four to five lengths clear at the moment of Ultimate Way in second. Change for the better third. For a million nearer fourth. And Demiris Giza fifth. And we'll step over the fourth. And over the fifth as well. Racing in virtual Indian file, just change for the better. Alongside Ultimate Way, almost. Although Demiris Giza's now jumped past for a million nearer. A message from Grey saying, Where are these comms? They're coming. One more race to do after this one. Uh, it's Straw Doll in the lead. Come on, Ultimate Way in second. Change for the better third. Now, I've got to be fair, he doesn't do that. He doesn't pester me for them at all. He's good like that. He, he, in fact, he gets more confused if I send him early. He sort of forgets to notice them sometimes. Anyway, Straw Doll's in the lead. From change for the better second. Ultimate way is third. And Demiris Geezer and Vermillion Nira at the back. Well, this leader has opened up by eight lengths now. Maybe six to eight, probably. Change for the better and ultimate way. And Vermillion Nira and Demiris Geezer. So it's all going to come down to whether this horse in front can stay there or whether it's gone off too quick and he's going to set it up for one of these four behind. Made one or two predictions earlier in the day and got them totally wrong, so I'm saying nothing this time. Straw Doll passes the ambulance, which surely should be following them round and not parked facing the other way, but that sort of things that still used to go on about. The strangely placed and abandoned looking ambulances facing them in the wrong direction as they get over the seventh. I expect it would take too much computer power or whatever they call it to have an animation of an ambulance following them around it would look quite good though wouldn't it they get over the eighth straw doll is in the lead 
ultimate way is second and change for the better under Mary's geezer with a million nearer after that one well as they get to the night thinking about it would a an ambulance or a car like they normally are following them take up any more computer generated pixel power or whatever it's called the three horses one I don't know I don't know it all works for an expert and all that sort of stuff anyway they turn around past the four furlong pole and head towards the next and straw doll is in front ultimate ways in second A million nearer is back in third and change for the better and finally Demiris Giza so just a couple more to get over then two furlongs still to go and ultimate way has now gone on into the lead. this is the third last actually and over that one they go and ultimate way is the first one to go for home it looks like straw dot is beating a rather hasty retreat as they get over the second last and ultimate way may have slipped the field here because i don't think he's coming out of the pack fast enough the million nearer is trying to joshua sutherland's horse has managed to get itself boxed in as they jump the last but it's ultimate way racing up the hill with less than half a firm to go it's not going to be caught and the million nearer second change for the better another bad ride by the jockey in third but ultimate way took it pretty comfortably for Leon Van Rensburg and I think even with a clear one Josh Sewell probably wouldn't have got to him. A million nearer it is it takes it. No it isn't it's ultimate way that takes it. Too much waffling I forgot the name of the winner. Ultimate way the winner for Leon Van Rensburg. A million nearer for James Shea was second. Change for the better Joshua Sutherland third. Demiris Giza for Graham Clutterbuck fourth and the long time leader Straw Doll for David Robertson was fifth. <laughs>